Hey folks, Blameon13 here from PCG and welcome back to some more OBS tutorial videos. In today's video we're just going to look at the best and ideal settings for OBS when you're looking to record in 1080p at 60 frames per second. We'll just try to keep this video short and sweet and not get into too much detail. We'll just give you the basics and get you started on your way to recording in 1080p recording gameplay and streaming. Uh, just note uh, OBS will only record in the quality that your monitor can output, so if you have a 1080p monitor, if you try and record OBS at 4K, it's going to come out blurry. It must be relative to your monitor, okay? So let's get on to the video and let's see the settings and let's get through it here. So of course the first thing we want to do is open your OBS and then straight away we want to head over to your settings. And then down general, uh, nothing really needs to change along here. Don't worry about anything in your general settings. Uh, stream also, uh, you'd set up your own stream stuff. This isn't relevant to the video itself. Then output, we're going to focus mainly on recording at the moment. So, of course, this is great out as I'm recording at this present time and moment. The first thing we want to do is go to your output mode and go to advanced. And then head down. Select your recording path to whatever folder, of course, you have it set to. Recording format, I suggest always using MP4 because it's just more it's user friendly for most programs will accept MP4 files. Uh, encoder, select your encoder will be your NVIDIA NVENC H.264 brackets new. Rescale output, set that to 1920 by 1080, please. Uh, customer Mr. Assassins, leave that as blank. And then rate control, we want to hit that at CBR. And then your bit rate is the most important part. 16,000 is the requirement for 1080p. So make sure it is set to 16000. Keyframe intervals, set that to 2. And then preset, you can probably change that. I like to go to max quality depending on how powerful your rig is you want to set that to max quality and then your profile set that to high uh, click on look ahead uh, click on psycho visual tuning your gpu will be set to zero and max b frames will be set to two and just take a moment to look through these settings and then we'll just move on to the next thing so that's the recording setup. We'll move over to streaming now. So set over to your streaming section in your output mode. Uh, once again, encoder will be set the same. Rescale output 1920 by 1080p. Uh, rate control CBR. Your bitrate for your stream will be 9500 kbps. That's 9500. Your keyframe interval will be 2. And again, preset max quality profile high. Unclick look ahead. Your GPU will be set to zero and max B frames to two. Now this will set up your recording and streaming to output at 1080p. And then now we will go and set the FPS. Uh, OBS only lets you select either 30 or 60 as the highest. So we'll move over and we'll have a look at that now. Now we want to set up our FPS. So along the left hand side we want to head down to video. And it brings up these options. Base, canvas, resolution set it to 1920 by 1080 I'd, I'd put scaled resolution also 1920 by 1080 uh, downscale filter make sure it's set to Lanxos sharpen scaling 36 samples and then common FPS value select that and hit 60 this will give us a recording of 1080p at 60 frames per second also giving us a stream output of 1080p at 60 frames per second and there's nothing else really that we need to set up. Uh, it's pretty straightforward. You want to be in your output, select your recording settings, select your streaming settings, and then head to video and make sure you have your canvas resolution, output resolution, and your common FPS values all set at 1080 and 60 frames per second. Hopefully you find this video useful, folks, and enjoy your recording and streaming ventures. Once again, folks, thank you all for watching. I hope you find that video useful. It's just short and sweet. It's not in too much detail. I don't want to overwhelm some people. If you use those settings that I just showed you, you will get 1080p at 60 frames per second when recording on OBS. And just, of course, remember, again, OBS will only record that 
your monitor is capable of outputting, which is mine's a 1080p monitor, 140 hertz. Obviously, the OBS won't go that high, so 1080p at 60 frames per second is the best that I can hope for, even though I'm supporting a rig that is more than capable of producing 4K at 60 frames per second. Anyway, I'll just end this video by showing you a few clips of how the recordings look. And uh, yeah, hopefully you find this useful, folks. Uh, don't forget to hit that like button. It helps me massively with the YouTube algorithm. And once again, thank you all for watching. Stay safe, and I'll see you all in the next one.